Yes, otters hold hands when drifting on the water, and you will learn why in just a minute. Welcome to the fascinating world of sea otters, a charismatic and intelligent species of marine mammals. Grooming is a critical part of an otter's life. With the densest fur in the animal kingdom, they rely on this fur to keep warm, as they lack blubber. A healthy sea otter's fur is so well groomed that water never touches their skin. Even their pups have a special lanugo coat that keeps them afloat, as they can't swim well initially. Mothers are diligent in caring for their pups, often wrapping them in kelp like a natural seatbelt to keep them safe while they forage. Sea otters are also remarkable for using tools. They are one of the few marine mammals known to do so. They have a clever way of eating shellfish and invertebrates by banging them on rocks. Some otters even have a favorite rock that they store in a loose fold of skin, almost like a built-in pocket. Sea otters are social animals, and this is especially true for the young pups. In aquariums, you may observe young otters under two years old playing and wrestling, mimicking behaviors they would naturally display in the wild. Now, let's talk about one adorable behavior unique to sea otters, rafting. Otters often hold paws to stay together in groups, particularly when they're sleeping. This is not just an endearing sight, it's a practical survival strategy, ensuring safety in numbers and preventing them from drifting apart during rest. As enchanting as they are, sea otters play a vital role in their ecosystems. They help maintain the balance of the kelp forests by controlling populations of sea urchins and other invertebrates that feed on kelp. This makes sea otters not only a keystone species but also an indicator of ocean health. Their playful nature, intelligence, and ecological importance make sea otters a species worth admiring and protecting. By understanding and appreciating these incredible animals, we can take steps to ensure their survival and the health of our oceans.